What's going on? What's going on everyone? Welcome back to another video on the channel. Now today we're gonna go over a couple of softwares that you might need to install to get the, the, the AFK method working. I'm sorry that the last time it wasn't working for you guys. I've been in the Discord for the guys who created the software for like a really long time and I'd forgotten that I had installed those drivers and those service packages for Windows. So that's completely my fault. So um, I'm gonna put a screenshot of the stuff that you need to install. I'm also gonna put a screenshot in the description. I mean, uh, I'm gonna put a links in the description. There's two piece of, there's two links in the description. One is for um, a GitHub link. As soon as you download that, just install that one. And the other one is gonna be a Renoir zip file. So once you download that file, just unzip it and then there'll be a little batch file in there that says install all or something like that. Just click on that to install all the software. It's going to keep popping up. Just click, just keep clicking on yes, on yes. It's all safe. I promise you it's from a reliable source. And then um, after that, you're going to restart your computer and then this ticket exploitation software should work. Okay. So because I have, and the reason why I know that was the problem is because I logged on to my girlfriend's laptop. I was trying to run, run the remote play and the remote play would not work for me until I installed the software. So that's completely my bad, I apologize. Okay, so let me show you that the ticket software is 100% working. So I am gonna go to, first of all, you're gonna see like how much money I have at the moment. So at the top of my screen, you can see that Yes, I have 55 million. I'm gonna go down to my garage. Um, inside my garage, I'm gonna go to tooling parts and you can see I have a ton of engine swaps, right? And I have a ton of car parts. These are not cars, these are car parts. Most of these cars I haven't even, some of these cars I haven't even owned yet. So yeah, the ticket software is still working. They haven't patched it as of yet, so all you need to do, once you have everything set up, like I said, install the GitHub link first, and then after that, you un you unzip the zip file, you click on the little batch file at the top, it's gonna say install all, click on that one, and it's gonna keep installing the stuff, just keep click clicking on yes, whenever it asks you to, and then once that's finished, you, un you restart your computer, once you restart your computer, you open up the, the remote play, and then you open up this, ticket software right and then you hover over cafe menu like that and then you just start look as soon as i press the start button it's going to automatically start with no problem right wait a minute oh sorry so let me close this sorry you have to you have to start this after the remote play is open yes i noticed that and as you see I made a little error in the video and I'm making sure that I correct it before, you know. So guys, as you can see in the video, as soon as I press the start button, it did not want to work at first. And that's because my controller was not plugged in and I needed to restart that software because I ran remote play before I, I no, I ran this before I had remote play on. But now as soon as I press the start button, it went in and started working. And as you can see, it's just gonna work fine. Um, I don't wanna stretch the video out any longer. So if this video was somewhat informative, helpful or whatnot, please like, comment, and subscribe. I'm sure those are the software that you need to get up and running. I'm just gonna speed this part of the, this part of the video up so you can see that I'm actually gonna get tickets and whatnot. All right, so peace.